Priscilla, a 23 year old teacher, is seeking a recommendation letter from St. Louis College of Education in Kumasi to help her travel abroad after completing her licensure exams. She believes the teaching profession in Ghana is not respected. In our country, Ghana, they devalue teachers. When I travel to other countries, though, they put value on teachers, so they increase my salary. So why should I stay in Ghana? I have to leave the country for a better place. Ghana is grappling with a teacher shortage, but most trained teachers are planning to relocate abroad for better conditions of service. Fredos, a second-year teacher trainee, plans to leave Ghana after graduation due to the unenticing and discouraging conditions of service. If I have any chance, where I'm going. There are a lot of students in Ghana, a lot of students. Some are even completing without getting jobs. So me leaving is not going to make anything for short. There are a lot of students. The high attrition rate in Ghana's education sector is a significant threat to the nation's education and development as most teachers are forced to leave due to the high cost of living and meagre salaries. It's very, very worrying uh, in the sense that um, uh, you use the nation's resources to train teachers who are supposed to come and uh, educate our youth and our children for us. And then it ends up that they just leave the country for greener pastures. And so one, it means that we are losing resources. And then again, you see, it's not about, some, someone will say that when they leave, others will come. But experience also matters. So if the conditions of living are not improved, obviously people will leave. The education sector faces a potential increase in teachers leaving the country unless government improves the service conditions of teachers. Well, for most of these teacher trainees, they even have plans of leaving the country should the opportunity present itself even before they complete their education because for them, the teacher is not respected in the country due to low remuneration. They expect to move to where their services would be appreciated. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3 News, Kumasi.